Let's open a Novo Pro box. Here you will find the main unit and a quick start guide, as well as a couple of other small boxes. One of them has the power adapter, while the other contains an HDMI cable, a micro USB power cable, a remote control, and a wall mount bracket. The Quick Start Guide provides the necessary information to help you set up the Novo Pro device quickly. You might want to take a look at this first. The wall mount bracket has an adhesive strip so that it can be easily attached to the back of a display, making mounting the Novo Pro quite simple. All connections are made on the back of the device. Use the supplied HDMI cable to provide audio and video from the Novo Pro to your display. Ethernet is provided as an option to the built-in Wi-Fi so that the Novo Pro can be hardwired to the network for the fastest, most robust, and reliable connection. If you need additional storage, you can insert a micro SD card. Up to 64 gigabytes is supported. A Kensington lock connection is also available. You may also connect a USB mouse for quick and easy configuration of the Novo Pro device. The USB connection can also be used in conjunction with a touch-enabled flat panel or interactive projector. Lastly, connect the micro USB power cable. You can plug it into the supplied AC-DC adapter, or if your display can supply USB power with 5 volts at 1.5 amps, you can power the Novo Pro from that USB port as a convenient option. Once everything is set up properly, you should be able to see the Novo Pro home screen on the connected display. There are a couple of LEDs lit up at the front. The green one is the power on indicator, while the blue one is Ethernet network activity indicator. There's also an IR receiver window for the remote control to the right.